Now that you've practiced the open part of the open close stroke and the close part of the open close stroke, you're ready to put the two together. Think of it like this. Open, close, open, close, open, close, open, or push, pull, push, pull, push, pull, push, or down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, or drop, lift, drop, lift, drop, lift, drop, lift. You could even think wrist, fingers, wrist, fingers, wrist, fingers, wrist, fingers. That is the open close stroke. Again, it's a wrist stroke. You get two sounds for the price of one. It's best learned in the American position at the nine inch height or the half height, we, we could call that. Practice that one hand at a time. Practice your right, practice your left. And then practice the two together. It's going to take some getting used to. It's not a comfortable um, wrist motion if you've never done it and if you're not used to that type of thing. So you have to have a lot of patience, start slow, and work at it. I recommend setting a metronome for a comfortable tempo. Uh, for me, I have 100 right here. And just playing them for three to five minutes at a time to develop that comfort. Mm -hmm. I'll do eight notes. You can play the open close stroke in the German, American, and French position. You can also play it in low, half, and full heights. Most people play it in the American position at a half height. You'll find as you want to get faster with it, uh, you'll need to go to lower heights and keep the fingers closer to the sticks. If you go on YouTube, you'll see a lot of people who demonstrate this and show how to do this and there's differing opinions on where to start. Some say you should start here at a vertical uh, angle for the stick and return to that position. Some say, which by the way is the full position, some say start here at the half position and some you'll see who are very fast at it achieve speed by staying in a very low position. So again it doesn't hurt to practice it in all positions, all heights. That's entirely up to you and what you want to get out of the stroke. I myself am new to the open close technique stroke and it, uh, it, it took me a little while to get used to it, but I, I am used to it now and I, I kind of like it. Um, I am not an authority on it, uh, what I've given you in my videos is just a glance at it, a, a look at it, I suppose. If you really want to study it, I suggest you go on YouTube and look up a guy named Gordy Knutson. He's got great videos on this technique and stroke, and he explains it very well. And uh, if you really want to master it, check him out.